Nina Warhurst, a presenter on BBC Breakfast, was lauded for her unexpected knack for bargain hunting. The conversation about Nina's love for a yellow reduction sticker became apparent during a conversation about a Netflix program that was about to return to the streaming site. Co-host John Kay explained on air to his co-star, you can watch series 1, 2 and now 3 on Netflix from tomorrow. Nina then retorted, always late to the party, aren't I John? Countering her comments, he let slip her secret love for looking after the pennies. The host quipped, you know what you're not late for, getting a bargain. Expressing her passion for finding deals, Nina replied, never. I love a yellow label. Absolutely love one. You might have noticed, though, how prices are labeled in supermarkets is beginning to change. Electronic labels are replacing the yellow stickers, apparently. How do we get the bargains then? She elaborated, we're all familiar with those stickers that denote a bargain. But what does it all mean for those? For years now, supermarkets have displayed discounts using stickers, but a few shoppers have noticed digital price displays. John commented, Aldi began using electronic price tags back in 2021, and Lidl brought them into stores earlier this year. He then confirmed that MS and Morrisons are also testing the technology to free up staff and enhance customer service. It was at this point that the two presenters decided it was probably a good idea to include a finance expert in the discussion as they welcomed Lynn Beatty to the program. Lynn, who displayed extensive bargain knowledge, explained, Never is there more excitement than when I post an amazing yellow sticker bargain. The finance expert told the hosts, The time I got a 10p carrot cake, I can't tell you how much people loved it. Supermarkets are always updating their technology to reduce waste and have fewer yellow sticker products there, but they're never going to get it exactly right. It was at this point that it was verified that Lidl, Aldi, Morrison's, MS, Co-op, and Waitrose would all retain their individual and physical discount labels instead of going electronic. 